We're like underground. We got some ice cream that's built on an island. It's cold. It's the only way I can see the beautiful surroundings. Today we arrive in our 25th country since we left home almost three years ago. We spend the day exploring Lithuania's capital city before heading to a castle. Good morning. morning. We're in Vilnius in Lithuania. It's the capital city of Lithuania. It's our first time in this country. So we're pretty excited to be here. We are off to a walking tour. We're supposed to be meeting everyone over at the town hall there. And we're running a bit late, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, we, we should got... probably keep going. <laughs> Really cool, we're like underground. We got beetroot soup. Wow. And there's little pieces of meat in it as well. It's very liquidy. Yeah. Yeah. It's very nice, it's quite sweet. I guess beetroot are like kind of sweet. It's very nice. So as you can see I finished my plate and it was really nice. That was one of my favourite soups I've ever had. So I got the potato dumplings and they've got curd inside and then a sauce which is butter and onion. And I got meat pockets, which are really good. Myron managed to finish up. Myron managed to finish up. I think one of these potatoes would have been enough. It was so filling. It was really good, but I just could not. I'm so hungry. Now I just can't eat anything else. Yeah. I'm the same. I'm so full after that. Yeah, I can't believe you finished that. You were struggling. <laughs> we had some traditional desserts here, but I can't fit anything more in. Very nice filling me up. Now we're going to head back out and do some more exploring. And because we were so full from lunch, we got some ice creams as well. It's not really lunchable, is it? No. <laughs> Very full still. <laughs> Our next stop is to go and see the Church of St. Casimir, which I have seen all over Instagram because it's beautiful and pink. So it's not quite as pink as what it looks like online. So I'm not sure if I've got the wrong church because there is another pink church here. So we might go for a walk and have a look at that one. But yeah, this one is beautiful, but it's not quite as pink as what I thought it would be. And here's the other pink church that's really orange. <laughs> yeah, like a nice peachy colour. It's nice. But not pink. <laughs> so we are now done exploring the city. It's not the end of the vlog yet though because we're heading about half an hour west to go to a castle. You can see our van through that little gap in the trees. Do you have the keys? I'm trying to find them. I'm trying to just dig around and find them. But I don't Without them. looking. So we're driving to the castle and it's been about four or so hours since lunch and we're feeling quite hungry. And we've seen this burger place like, I don't know, I think I've seen like five or six of them around town and we just saw one so we thought we'd stop and get some burgers. I did Google it before and the review said it was kind of like McDonald's-ish but I think it's, I don't know if it's local to Lithuania or just like this kind of area of Europe. So I'm excited for some food. Not traditional food but you know. So we just got our food. Um, the menu on the board is in Lithuania, but if you ask, they have an English menu. It came to 9 euros and 45 cents for two large meals. So that's pretty good. Now it's time to get back on the road. It is cold and windy, so let's get some jackets on. How cool is this castle? So good. Would have been so well protected having the lake around it. 
So a good tip if you want to come to the castle but not go inside is to come late at night because they seem to leave all the grounds open to get to it and walk around. It's almost 9 o'clock at night and it's still open. It's 11 euros each to get into the castle which isn't a bad price at all compared to some castles we've been to in Europe. But for us we're on limited time while we're in Lithuania and we've got to watch our budget so it wasn't a priority for us to go inside but we definitely wanted to see the outside. And yes, I'm wearing sunglasses at night time because I forgot my other glasses and these are prescription. So it's the only way I can see the beautiful surroundings. <laughs> vlog in Vilnius. It's been Sadly. such a good day. I don't know, I've been quite like pleasantly surprised by Lithuania. Mm. Not that we weren't expecting it to be good, just that we didn't really know anything about Lithuania no, at didn't all. didn't have any expectations. Yeah. Hadn't really heard a lot about it, but... And it's been it's, really good. It's a beautiful little gem. We are heading north now. We're still going to be in Lithuania for a few more days. We've still got more things to do. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really appreciate it. Please give us a like and comment. And please subscribe. We're getting so close to a thousand subscribers. Yeah. And we're super excited to hit that. It'll just, I don't know, it'll just feel really nice. Nice round number. Yeah. If you're new to our channel, we make videos three to four times a week. We live in our van full time and we travel around Europe just vlogging the adventure. Yeah. If you like that, subscribe. <laughs>